everyone. Hi, my name is Welta, and today we're going to make a steak stir fry. So come on, come cook with me. <laughs> okay, guys, so what we're going to use for this meal is I have cube steak. I have the green and the, um, the, green and the red bell pepper, and we're going to use an onion, and we need some garlic. Okay, and then for the side dish, there's going to be some rice. And we're gonna top the stir fry on top of the rice when we're done cooking it. Okay, so let's get started. <laughs> okay, you guys, so here we are. We're gonna chop up all the vegetables. Okay. So let's start with the bell peppers. And I think I wanna leave them like slice like this um, maybe i should slice them we'll do this okay i have my niece over tonight so making a meal for her also miss angelica came to visit <laughs> so Going to make a good meal for her. All right. We'll slice some more. Okay. And then we're going to finish this. How's everyone doing? Hope everyone's doing good and having a good day. Okay. All right, now time for the um, onions. I'm just gonna slice the onions. I'm gonna keep those long. And yes, I soak them in water so that I don't have to cry from the onions. Okay, let's take this part off. I used to make stir fry all the time, like chicken stir fry, beef stir fry. Or whatever it may be. It's been a while. I'm thinking, I wish I had got some carrots. I think I have carrots in the fridge. I might add carrots to this also. more vegetables the more vegetables the better right <laughs> vegetables are good for you and i want to live a healthy life so i try to eat more vegetables but one thing i do need to work on is eating more fruit i'm bad at that i need to eat more fruit i'm gonna start buying more fruit i usually just eat um, bananas. I think bananas are like the main one that I eat. Here lately, I need to buy more fruit. That's what I'm gonna do. But at least I eat all my vegetables because honey, I eat a lot of vegetables. Okay. We can mix all the vegetables together when you cut them. It's okay. They're all going in the same pot to cook. I mean, the same. We're going to use the my wok skillet to cook all this. Okay. Just put a little slice in them. You can cut your vegetables whatever way you want to cut them, you guys. It's okay.
Okay. One thing I believe in is, in is eating a lot of vegetables and fruit also, but I'm just like bad at my fruit. I need to start eating more fruit, but vegetables, I eat so many vegetables and I believe that vegetables help you help keep you looking um, younger also. That's just my belief. So when I get older, I want to look younger. I want to look like, like I'm 20 years younger than my age. <laughs> That's why I always eat a lot of vegetables and I take a lot of vitamins. I'm a true believer in vitamins. So that's just me. Okay. And I believe in always doing at least a good 30 minute workout a day. Even if it's just marching in place, I think you should do that. Or well, that's what I do because I'm trying to be healthier now. Okay, so we're done with all the vegetables. So now you guys, let me see if I have any carrots. Hold on. Okay, I guess I don't have any carrots and I don't think my niece liked them anyway. So I'll, I'll pass on the carrots. But um, I already um, diced up the the steak you guys this is some cube steak that i bought for the stir fry so we're just gonna season the steak got some black pepper onion powder garlic powder And I'm gonna use some steak seasoning. Steak seasoning. Ooh, I think I'm about to see. <laughs> Ooh, honey. Sorry, guys. I tried to hold it, <laughs> but I couldn't hold it in. Okay, and this is the salt free seasoning. You guys know I don't like to use a lot of salt. Okay. Okay. And plus the soy sauce that we're going to use is salty enough. So you don't have to like put extra salt. So I'm going to add some soy sauce to this. Just one minute, you guys. Okay. So. I'm going to add some soy sauce to this, okay? I don't know. Let's just pour it a little bit. Okay. And then I also want to add some Worcestershire sauce. This stuff, okay? With just a tinch. Okay. And now we're gonna stir this together. Oh, sorry guys. I forgot to put some um some minced garlic. So hold on, let me show you. See, minced garlic, okay? And it's in water, so you just put a couple spoons of that in there. You know I love garlic. Okay. All right, so now you just stir all this together. And we're gonna go to the stove and we're gonna cook this, okay? We're gonna cook the meat first. All right? Okay, guys. Meet me at the stove. <laughs> okay, guys. So now we're going to go to the stove and we're going to cook the meat and the vegetables together. This meal is really fast and it's really easy. So 
and I already have my rice cooked. So come on, you guys. It's going to be a really easy, fast meal. So come on. Okay, sorry guys if it looks like my eyes are looking somewhere else every once in a while because I have to learn how to film in a new way. <laughs> I'm teaching myself all this stuff. I didn't know anything, but I'm teaching myself and I know I can do whatever I put my mind to and I will learn. So I'll get better. <laughs> okay, let's cook. <laughs> okay, you guys. So now we're going to um, cook the the meat first okay well we're, we're gonna cook the steak first so we're gonna put some oil in your wok let me try to put it up around here okay all right so now you grab your meat we'll let it get a little bit hot okay let's see all right one thing about the wok skillet you know it gets hot really fast okay all right so we're just gonna let this steak cook on each side let it cook really well okay and then when this cook you guys we're gonna grab the um we're gonna drain the some of this juice off of it and then we're gonna put the vegetables with it. So just let it cook. And I sliced it really thin, so it shouldn't take long. Okay, so just let it cook, you guys. Let the meat get done. Make sure it's done all the way. So I'm just going to keep tossing it, okay? When this is ready, we're going to put it to the side and then we're going to clean the skillet, the wok skillet, and then I'm going to cook the vegetables, but I'm going to do it separately and then we'll combine them together afterwards. Okay. doesn't take long for this to cook because I sliced it up really thin. Ten little pieces, so it should be good. And a few. I know Mother's Day is coming up soon. I think it's this Sunday, right? I got to think of a meal to cook for Mother's Day, you guys. What should I cook? I have some ideas in my head, but I haven't decided what I'm going to cook for Mother's Day.
my Mother's Day video. What should I cook? Hmm, I'm thinking. You guys know? Let me know if, what you think I should cook. Okay. All right, you guys. So this is done. So now we're going to get, I'm going to get a container to put this in. Okay. Hold on, you guys. I'll be right back. Let's turn the stove off first because this is ready. Now we're going to transfer it into a bowl and set it to the side, okay? And then I'm going to clean the wok. Clean this and um, we're going to um, cook the vegetables in here, okay? But I'm going to clean this first. Okay, you guys. So I have cleaned the, the, the wok skillet, okay? It's clean. So now we're going to add some oil and we're going to cook the vegetables. Okay. All right, so it should be hot now. Now we're going to add the vegetables. So just toss the vegetables around and I'm going to get some spices. I'm going to put my um, non-salt seasoning in this. Okay. <coughs> okay, so. I'm going to put some of this in here, okay? The salt-free seasoning. Open it up right there. So put that all over it. Then I'll put some more onion powder. And some more garlic powder. Okay? And you just keep tossing it. Okay, guys, you just keep tossing the vegetables. Okay, you guys. So, you just keep tossing your vegetables until it gets to the, um, well, I don't like for my vegetables to cook like too done i like for my vegetables to have like a crunch to it i think it's so good when it has that little crunch to it so i'm gonna turn this off in a few because it's almost done i mean i'm gonna add the <clears throat> we're gonna add the meat to it next okay so my vegetables are looking just the way i want them to look so they only need to cook a few more minutes. And while they're cooking, we're going to add the beef to it right now. So now we're going to add the beef, okay? All right. So I added the beef to it. The steak. And I used the cube steak. And I just sliced it up, you guys. So, and just mix everything together. Let me taste it. 
see. Make sure I got the right amount of spices on it. Mmm. Good. Okay. All right, so let that cook for a few minutes, just a few minutes. And while that's cooking, I'm going to get the, um, I'm going to get some cornstarch. Okay, so I'm going to use cornstarch and the beef when it cooked earlier. I'm going to use the broth from the steak that I cooked and I'm going to add some cornstarch to it to make the um, sauce for this. Okay, so what I'm going to do is here's the beef stock from the um, steak we just cooked. Okay, this is the juice that came from it. So I'm going to use some cornstarch tablespoon of cornstarch and then you're just going to mix it with cornstarch so this is the steak broth that came from the steak when I cooked it so you're going to take a tablespoon of the cornstarch mix it with it just stir it all together make sure there's no lumps Just like that, you guys. Okay. Well, there's no lumps in here. Okay. So now what you're going to do is you're going to pour it over your meal. And you're going to stir it up. Stir it. Toss everything together. Okay. Ooh, this looks so good. My vegetables. I can't let them get too done, so we're gonna have to turn this off. This meal is ready, you guys. So now we're gonna make a plate. I have my rice already cooked, so we're gonna make a plate, okay? So let me turn the stove off. You guys, this is a very easy meal and it's so fast. It only takes a few minutes to cook this. Like you can cook this in 30 minutes. Okay, so this is done, you guys. You see that? Look at those vegetables. Don't they look delicious? Okay, so now you guys let's go make us a plate <laughs> okay you guys so now we're gonna make a plate okay so i have the rice it's really hot so bear with me okay so we have the rice okay you guys so your rice in there okay so now let's get the vegetables and the beef okay so now let's get some vegetables and the beef okay gonna put that on top of the rice all that good, good on top of that rice. There you go. Make my niece a plate because she likes to eat, honey. There we go. Trying to make it look appetizing. There we go. 
You see all those vegetables? Bell peppers, onions, and the steak all together, you guys. Makes a great meal. And there you have it. <laughs> oh, okay, let me make it clean a plate up. <laughs> okay. There you have it. There you have it. Steak stir fry served with rice. There you have it. Okay, guys, that's it. Thanks for joining me, and I'll see you next week. See you next week. See ya. <laughs>